Securing IoT devices is, is not to be underestimated. Obviously, it's like anything, you know, everyone's aware in this information age, the security of that and the safety of that information is a, is a paramount. There is a view that a sensor taking readings, recording temperature and humidity, or the depth of some water, or how full a bin is, or the lighting conditions, is not particularly sensitive data. But obviously pulling that together in a more, in big data becomes more of a bigger problem. So I think for us with security, it's around the, the consideration and the configuration of a, of a secure network that supports the sensors and securely passes those sensor readings and information through to a secure application. I think IoT devices will become the most common, um, a bit only because of volume. Sensor manufacturers and innovators and entrepreneurs are coming out with sensors now that you, we don't even know what they're going to do, but they're coming out all of the time. And I think, as I said about real-time information being so valuable, people want to get more and more of that information. So I think from a volume perspective, they will be the most commonplace type of sensor or connecting device to a network, um, but obviously on an IoT network, you've still obviously got your traditional networks that we all know of in the office and at home, but volume, I think IoT sensors will certainly dominate the landscape. I think for Pinnacle, you know, we've, we have a plan, we've got a continued growth plan. We know we've done very well now for three years, as I say, 20, 30% year on year growth. And for us, we're still targeting that continued growth. There are key areas for us as an organisation that will support that. The Internet of Things absolutely is, is one of those strands. Um, from our networking and the networking heritage and network infrastructure, we will still continue to do a lot of that. Um, wireless in particular is a very strong area of focus for Pinnacle. Um, you know, over the years now we've done deployments in so many different environments. I think we can put wireless wherever it needs to go and that's obviously from the outline designs through to the delivery and the support. So I think those are our key areas around infrastructure, wireless and Internet of Things.